all right so in this video i'm going to take you through what chat gpt is and how can you use it to get a better job to make more money and become a better professional a lot of people are panicking about how chat gpt is going to replace their jobs it might replace some jobs but if you watch this video till the end you will become very confident that it's going to help you secure a better job in this year itself <laughs> Cool. So to use ChatGPT, you have to go to this website called chat.openai.com. You will create an account, and as soon as you do that, you will see this screen right here. Here on ChatGPT, you can actually chat with AI, which is this big repository of information. It has scanned the entire internet. It has data till 2021, and you can ask it whatever you want. And it's not just about questions. You can actually ask it to role play and ask you specific interview questions. give you problem statements help you form a better routine if you want to make scripts it will do that we will i will actually show you all the different prompts that you can create but the question here is that chat gpt can help you reduce the time it takes to create content to create text to create essays articles if there's anything that is around text generation or script generation chat gpt can help you achieve all those things very very easily so how does it work right for example if i say go to chat gpt and write suggest me ways to get a high paying job in less than 40 to 45 seconds it's going to give you some very very good pointers but right now our prompt is pretty much a very generic prompt right so it's going to give me some examples it says get a good education now let's just say you got four or five answers and you want to act on one of these you can now ask chat gpt to extrapolate to go deeper into a specific point so if i feel that i don't know how to build a strong network you can write expand on point number 3 and give me actionable steps sure here are some actionable and by the way i wrote actionable instead of actionable but it recognized what i was trying to say so now it is giving me some steps that can help me build a strong network attend industry events join professional associations utilize linkedin the most common use case for chat gpt is to generate ideas so let's just say that you're trying to build a portfolio and you don't have any good problem statements so you can say give me three ux design problem statements that are based on indian audiences for ios easy to understand ground level problem sure here are three ux and problem statements based on indian audiences for ios so a lot of people struggle with finding you know problem statements and case study topics chat gpt can help you generate problem statements and some of them make a lot of sense it's going to give you problems around a mobile ticketing system an app that connects indian farmers with relevant resources all of these problem statements make more sense if you feel that three are not enough you can say give me three more and it will give you three more there is no end right and it serves you very very efficiently it's not just about problem statements you can also ask it for ideas so you can say give me one really good idea for an app that can help me serve college students without any complicated features here's an app that could help college students without any complicated features a course college course planner this app would allow college students to easily plan out their course schedule for each semester the app would generate a schedule that meets all the requirements you can see that these ideas are not just garbage right like they they do make sense and the more you refine your prompt the better chat gpt will get at helping you so this entire concept of fine tuning your prompts is called prompt engineering so next after generating ideas you can also use chat gpt for role playing as well so let's just say imagine you are a senior product designer at a big tech company in bangalore what would be your five questions to me when i apply for a ux design 
internship okay so i've asked chat gpt to become a senior product designer and now it's going to give me five questions right that some senior product designer might ask me can you provide examples of ux design projects how do you approach design process how do you stay up to date with latest design trends right imagine how difficult all of this was to figure out on your own by just you know relying uh, on articles and google and all of these things but here you can ask chat gpt to role play and become something else in fact if i say that when i answer please rate me out of 10 okay i'm sorry but i'm an ai language model and i have the ability to rate your answers or provide general guidelines for answering these types of questions during a job interview for the first question it's important to have specific examples of ux so now because it can't rate and so for example chat gpt is not very very good at math because it's essentially a language model so it works on words and semantics but here it said that i'm actually giving you tips for each and every question right and it's not just mumbo jumbo stuff like when the question is how do you approach the design process it clearly states that you have to include your user needs you have to create prototypes and wireframes so it does a lot right it does a lot now let's talk about social media let's just say that you want to have a real idea or a post idea you can say suggest me three social media real ideas around ai and design keep them creative and simple to execute here are three social media real ideas around ai and design ai design inspiration and let's see the third one ai and design and popular culture the intersection of ai and design and popular culture such as movies tv shows video games right so let's just say you like a specific idea now you can ask chat gpt to create a script create a 60 second real script for idea 3 keep it witty now it's going to create a 60 second script it actually shows like an opening shot of a futuristic cityscape there's a narrator it has given roles to the people in the script itself right like look how creative this thing can get it is absolutely unbelievable but more than this once you've shot this reel you can also ask gpt to write a caption and also give you the hashtag so if i want to say write an instagram caption for this reel keep it within 30 words also include trending hashtags Awesome. It has actually created a pretty legit Instagram caption with proper hashtags. With proper hashtags. It says design inspiration, future design, science fiction. Crazy. Crazy, right? So you got your real script, you got your caption, you got your hashtags. In fact, I can also repost the same thing on LinkedIn. So write a supporting LinkedIn post for this script. keep it actionable here is a linkedin post that could support the social media real script ai is really revolutionizing the world of design not just science fiction it actually knows the tone that works for each of these platforms can you imagine it can actually sense that this is the kind of stuff that people engage with and it says that also don't forget to check out the reel on our instagram page for more on this exciting topic so it's cross selling as well next use case is around copywriting so you can use this for writing hooks as well give me five hooks for a youtube video for ai and design topics here are five hooks for a youtube video about ai and design five mind blowing examples of ai powered design the future of design is here so you what you can say is you can write give me five witty one liner headlines one liner article headlines around ai design and tech here are five witty one liner articles a lion invasion designing the future with ai one pixel at a time tech meet design the love affair of the century i mean it's still trying right like it's not like the, the these are not going to help you uh then i also wanted to show rephrasing so rephrasing is pretty pretty cool let's just say i would copy a specific thing and add a rephrase before it so i would have rephrase semicolon 
paste a big paragraph and it would just rephrase the entire thing so you can pick something from the internet rephrase it instead of you know uh figuring out how to reword it in your own personal way you can pick any paragraph and rephrase it and it does a pretty good job i'm just picking content from the previous conversation and it's it's doing it very very well in fact you can also say provide an outline for this and it would create a cool outline so it creates headings it splits it into hook and topic so there's introduction there's body it is giving bullet points for the body there's a conclusion as well with the call to action imagine the amount of clarity one can get if they use this right like what i recommend you folks is that you start using chat gpt to get better problem statements and moving forward i'm going to show you how this can help you for your interviews and also get a routine and a list of resources for your specific domain so we spoke about the interview questions right now you can say give me a weekly routine to help me improve my ui design skills include ui ux resources and their urls so i'm saying that give me a weekly routine and also give me web resources so that i can check out those resources and also make notes so it's saying for monday this is what you can do okay it's given me like specific ui design skills uh review design principles it is also recommending me articles uh of different websites the elements of user experience the principles of beautiful web design for tuesday it's giving me like a proper uh set aside some time to put your design skills into practice working on a personal project recommending me to check out dribble ux project skill share you know for a person who's just entering you don't need any mentor you don't need any other person to answer your questions because this can help you build a routine this can help you prepare for your interviews and it's all about how creative you are so at this point because of this technology it is no longer about ideas or information because that is all available here the only skill that you need to develop now moving forward is the ability to ask the right questions and knowing how to communicate with ai see the strongest force on this planet is the ability to have human beings cooperate with you towards a certain goal right if you know how to talk to people if you know how to communicate with people you always have that extra edge now if you know how to communicate with these tools like chat gpt you will have even more leverage that is what i would recommend you folks to focus on moving forward to of course use chat gpt to prepare yourself for your job and get the relevant skills and get guidance but also know how to ask the right questions how to fine tune your prompt right because we just saw that you can have interview preparation routine formation so many things and i have just made like a weekly goal you can ask it for a monthly goal or whatever it is that you want to do right and if you want to learn how chat gpt works the only source that you need to explore is their documentation so i would recommend you to go check out their documentation and make notes right and whatever prompts that have given you right now try different versions of them and in the description i'm going to share some linkedin threads go through those linkedin threads they share some very very valuable information around cool chat gpt prompts that you can practice if you're here for the first time my name is ansh mehra and i help students learn ux design from scratch i have a 15 episode course where i take you through the entire basics help you build your first portfolio i'll put the link in description but apart from that we talk about design technology and psychology so make sure you subscribe because we're going to have a lot of interesting content coming up i'm very excited to see where ai takes us because this is just like a basic video on how gpt works moving forward what i'm going to make in depth videos on each of these prompts and you know there's mid journey there's stable diffusion all of these tools that are going to change 2023 for us right so super excited about it and i will see you in the next video see you folks bye